it's Jeff Chalmers here from discoveredoublebase.com and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I just finished filming a new lesson on how to change the strings on your double bass and I fitted a brand new set of Daddario Zyx light gauge which are a hybrid string. Um, very kindly sent to me by Daddario so I thought I'd put them on, have a play through and let you know what I think of them. So my usual string is made by Piastro, it's Eva Parazzi Vike, which means light gauge. Um, and I'm a big fan of those strings and I use them in my uh, tutorial videos. But I also enjoy uh, Daddario uh, Helicore Hybrid light gauge and I actually had them on my base for a couple of months this summer. I find that they can cut through the mix, uh, they're a bit brighter to my ears anyway. And that's one thing actually I just quickly wanted to mention is that all of this is very subjective and it really depends on what your bass is like, what's going to work with your instrument. So you should be experimenting to try and find out for yourself. But that said, I'll let you know what I think of these, um, these new Zyx light gauge. Well, first of all, let's have a quick listen to how they sound. So they're quite um, a bit brighter than the uh, Eva Parazzi that I'm used to, but they're not as bright as a string like a uh, Tomastic Spiracore. Um, to me, they feel like a lot of the synthetic strings, uh, uh, Piastro Obligato or the Eva Parazzi strings, but they're a little bit edgier, but they're really well balanced across the bass. And then what I like about them is it's, the pitches are very clear, so I find it I find it very comfortable to play. Yeah, I find it easier to hear that I'm in tune with um, a brighter string. So these are really nice for me. They also feel a little bit thicker than the Helicore Hybrid lights, just that they've got a bit more substance to them, um, and they've got a little bit more body to the sound. I also find them a little, that they've got a touch more volume as well. They're easily as loud as the uh, Piastro strings that I normally use. And yeah, they sing quite well further up the neck. And overall, they're very comfortable to play. Really nice pit sound, really balanced, and I'm looking forward to trying them on some gigs. One thing that I sometimes have a problem with is cutting through in a band. Um, my bass can sometimes not have enough top end um, to really kind of come through. And I'd get that with Spiracores, but then I find it's a little bit overwhelming. So these are a nice balance for that. So how do they sound with the bow? Well, they're very clear, actually. They start fairly easily. And they're quite loud. And they cut through really nicely as well. So yeah, I, I really like them. I think that they're a really nice string. Um, I haven't used them on a gig yet, um, and I'm looking forward to doing so. So yeah, if you're interested in trying, um, trying them out, I'd certainly recommend uh, seeing how they sound on your bass. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.